I'm Nagito Komaeda. Nice to meet you. Nagito Komaeda. Nagito Komae Komaeda. I'm gonna totally forget that in about five seconds. Nagito. Ultimate lucky student? Wait, excuse me? That instantly puts you at a point of being important. Uh, along with my introduction, uh, I guess I'll tell you about my talent so you know why Hope's Peak Academy chose me. Uh, even if I tell you, in my case, it's a pretty disappointing talent. What do you mean? I'm lucky. I'm lucky. What are you talking about? That's not it. Uh, it's not a joke or anything. That's my actual talent. I'm the ultimate lucky student. At least that's what I'm called anyway. Ultimate lucky student? You're right. Through a countrywide lottery, apparently only one ordinary student is selected at random to attend. Hope Speak Academy as the ultimate lucky student. And that lucky winner just so happened to be me. Chosen by a lottery. Is that really okay? I mean, is luck even a real talent in the first place? Well, how strange. What happened? Your face looks troubled. Oh no, I'm not troubled or anything. <laughs> no, 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 it's fine. I have mixed feelings about this too. Someone like I never thought an average talentless high school student like me would ever enter Hope Speak Academy. At first I declined. I told them I didn't deserve it, but they told me they really wanted me to attend. Apparently, this so-called luck of mine is a talent that even the school doesn't fully understand. To research it, the school picks the ultimate lucky student every year through an annual lottery. Hope Speak Academy is amazing if they can actually research something as vague as luck. Well, thanks to that guy, a guy like me was able to... Thanks to that luck, a guy like me was able to attend Hope Speak Academy. So for that, I'm grateful. This is troubling. But on the other hand, I feel a little out of place here. It, it's so weird to be on the opposite side of this conversation now. <laughs> uh, sorry, I have a bad habit of viewing most things through a pessimistic lens. Uh, yeah, I guess that's it for my introduction. Nagito Komaeda. Komaeda. Uh, he doesn't seem like the most reliable guy, but he doesn't strike me as a bad person either. Okay. Now then, it's my turn. Yeah, I'm Hajima Hinata. And let me ask you a question. What is your ultimate talent? Uh, Hajima, what happened? It's nothing. I guess I'm still, still pretty confused about all of this. I'm having trouble remembering some things. I understand how your memory might be confused after suddenly getting into a situation like this. I'm sure you'll remember soon enough once you settle down. So I don't think you need to worry about it all that much. You're right. Yep. Then I guess we're done for our, with our introductions for now. Even though I don't know what's going on, I hope we can get along. I obtained a hope fragment. <laughs> oh. Wait, is that for gotcha? I hope that there's gotcha. Huh? Huh? I can nice. have this? It's really generous of you to give a gift to a piece of trash like me. Oh, what? Honey, no! Don't talk like that. What? Hajime, are you feeling sick? Oh, uh, no, not at all. Nope. I see, then it's okay. I thought you looked pale or something. I thought something was worrying you. Uh, but it'd be, it, it'd be weird if you weren't worrying at a situation like this. Nagito was laughing in a carefree way. But seeing him laugh like that was enough to distract me from my worries. Huh? What, is something wrong? Uh, no, how should I put it? I was just thinking about all the ways that you've been helping me so far. Thank you. Wow. Uh, I haven't done anything to receive your thanks, but for someone like me to be useful to you and to you and you and to receive your words of gratitude makes me happy. You're being too hard on yourself. <laughs> I mean, my talent is just having good luck. It's not like it comes from hard work, and it's not like I can do use it to do anything amazing. Regardless of how I lucky I am, or if that luck even exists, I'm just too unimpressive to truly matter. Oh, what the fuck? Unlike you guys, why do you sound so happy about that? It's possible that my talent might be more meaningless than yours, you know? I mean, I can't even remember what it is. <laughs> That's not There's really- no mistake. <laughs> he just subtly admitted that it was meaningless. <laughs> ah. 
That's not, that's not true. I'm sure that you have an amazing talent. I mean, if you don't, you wouldn't have been accepted into Hope Speak Academy. Somehow, when I see the way Nagito doesn't doubt me at all, I start to believe that he's right. He really does help me in so many ways. Hey. I know, if you'd like, let me help you remember. Let's see, a talent that suits Hajime. I see. What about the ultimate serenity? Which part of me did you look at to come up with a title like that? Is that even a useful ability? Uh, I'm pretty sure that abil the ability to bring serenity to others just by being there is really amazing. Let's see... <laughs> what about the ultimate clumsy student? Well, considering that I suddenly forgot what my talent was, that might be fairly accurate. What about the ultimate scatterbrain? Don't go that far, I don't want an ultimate talent like that. Wow. Hey, don't take it seriously, it was just a little joke. Then... <laughs> How about the ultimate spiky hair? Wait, that's you though. You have the ultimate spiky hair. That's not an ability at all! I know, right? Right. But it's going to be fine. I'm positive that you have a talent that's brimming with hope. Jeez, he's totally messing with me. But thanks to him, my feelings are lighter than they ever were. Could it be? Was that his goal all along? If so, maybe he's a good person after all. I guess it's too early to say. I need to get to know him better from now on. I hope we get to understand each other better, even if it's just a little bit of at a time. Aww, he's so cute! I was completely exhausted from hanging out with Nagito, so I re returned to my room. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna hate my life doing it. I'm gonna regret every second of this. I wonder what sort of motive Modem Hanakuma is going to prepare this time. Uh, kill me. <laughs> I'm so blessed to hear you say that to me. Uh. Okay. Oh man, what present do I give him? Oh Jesus, oh Jesus, oh Jesus. Um. A <laughs> gag ball? <laughs> <laughs> ah! Shut the fuck up! <clears throat> when you do, you end up making a funny face. <laughs> yeah, okay. Great! This is amazing! What an impressive display of harassment! <laughs> Even I'm about to lose sight of hope in the presence of... What, what, what the... Is he broken? <laughs> I think... I think Nagito's broken. <clears throat> I'm about to lose sight of that item. I would greatly appreciate it if you hurried up and put that dangerous looking item away. Dangerous? Dangerous? He didn't like the gag ball. Stop breaking video games. Look, I don't do this on purpose, alright? I didn't mean to break the game. Alright, alright, alright. Okay, so gag ball was a no-go. Even though Nagito said great, uh, it, uh, he did not like it, which is a shame. <laughs> Nagito's broken good. <laughs> I need to do gotcha. All right. I know exactly what to give our best friend. Oh, Nagito, I have a present for you. Oh, there you are. No! <laughs> you must be really bored to talk to a pest like me. You're right. <laughs> yep. 
Uh. <laughs> All right. Uh, I got a present for you. I have a couple ideas. I just have to pick the right one. All right. So, Nagito. I have this uh, apron dress. I'm sure you'd look great. Thanks. <laughs> yeah! Woo! I'm grateful to receive anything you give me, even if it's trash or leftover food. <laughs> <laughs> he liked it. <laughs> Oh ho ho! Hey, how's the apron dress and gag ball working for you? Hello there. Even if you ignore me, I'm already happy that our eyes have met. You really are a kind person. I literally spent the past two free times with you, bitch. Yay! Free time! Time to play dress up with Nagito some more. <laughs> Don't judge me. This is perfectly logical, chat. <laughs> Uyuhiko is so admirable. Great. Such attitude, such moxie. The title Ultimate Yakuza isn't just for show after all. Yeah, okay. Bring back, <laughs> bring back old Nagito. I actually want to beg you to spend time with me. After all, everyone else hates me. Me too. I should probably give him something that he'll actually like, right? I mean, you can't go wrong with giving people food. You know what? I'll just give you some cinnamon tea. Huh? I can have this? Thanks. Really generous of you to give a gift to a piece of trash like me. To be honest, I don't even know why I thought about talking to him. But I feel I felt like the more I left him alone, the bigger my worries would start to grow. <laughs> you have a scary look on your face. You don't have to be so cautious, you know. I won't do anything. As he said that, he smiled at me. Why is this guy... No, thinking about it is a waste of time. Hey. Are you thinking about doing something to me? Oh, pff. <laughs> doing something, something. No. That's wonderful. I'm totally up for... Okay, I don't mind at all. Don't mess with me! I'll never go along with your plans. Wow. That's a problem. I don't want you guys to lose sight of yourselves because you doubt and hate me. <laughs> I just want to see you guys embody hope. Oh, uh, there it is again. What in the world is this hope that you keep talking about? What are you planning to make us do? Why am I so misunderstood? I just want to believe in hope, you know? Hey. You should think about it seriously for once. What do you think hope is? <sighs> okay, here we go. He's right, I've never actually given it much thought. Hope, for him, hope is, hope is absolute good. It's something that's not here. All right, I'm gonna do all the wrong answers. Hope is absolute good. <laughs> that's right, oh, that was, I thought the first one was the right answer. Fuck. That's right, that's exactly it. And you guys have the potential to embody it. Do you understand? Hope is a positive force. Everything created by it is an absolute good. Well, as long obvious. as the seeds of hope have been planted, I will gladly kill someone or be killed in return. The fact that I'm alive right now is already hope. It's no use. I definitely don't understand what he's talking about. But even so, all I could say is it doesn't seem like he's trying to trick or trap anyone for the sake of his selfish desires. That's why this is especially troubling. Hey. Are we done talking, Hajime? That's disappointing, but we can still talk any time, right? See? After all, we're both friends who yearn for hope. Oh. Yeah, no, that's just you. All right. Here we go again. Why am I doing this? I literally hate this guy and he drives me nuts. But yet I can't stop myself. Now then. Hey. Yeah. 
Thanks. Uh, that reminds me, your talent is being the ultimate lucky student, right? Man. I happen to think it's extremely boring. For someone who's lucky, you still got dragged into this mess. Doesn't this stat seem ironic to you? That's not Not it. at all. This is simply the beginning of hope. Huh? Actually. I was born with a unique type of hope. This current situation is foreshadowing the ultimate luck that will be arriving afterward. What do you mean? Well... If everything that's happening now seems like bad luck, it's all going to result in good luck in the end. As long as I exist, that will definitely happen. <laughs> so I can't help feeling excited for what's going to happen. Seeing my beloved embodiments of hope trapped on this island and forced to kill each other so pathetically... Amazing! It's all just a preparation for the good luck that will arrive in the end! I'm going mad from excitement! What? You look confused. Isn't that obvious? He thinks the bad luck happening right now is just a preparation for good luck? What's wrong with him? Hey. Allow me to give you an example. Let's say you end up in a car accident and are hospitalized. On its own, this would seem like bad luck, right? Well, yeah. And... And then you meet a lovely nurse at the hospital, and ended up becoming a lovey-dovey happy couple. Doesn't this ending mean it was good luck? Well, maybe. See? You never would have met her at all if you hadn't experienced the bad luck of getting in a car accident. Isn't that right? It's always been my experience. The bigger the bad luck I experienced at first- This is exciting! The good luck that comes afterward is so big that it wipes out all of that bad luck. Does that- really happen to you? <laughs> Didn't I tell you? That is the talent I possess. That's why I'm called the ultimate lucky student. So that's why no matter what happens, he's always acting happy and upbeat. No matter who he, who is killed, it's just overshadowed by good luck later. Even though it's only a little bit, I sort of understand Nagito's belief, but he's definitely messed up. It's hard to imagine that there will be a day when we're able to really understand each other. I left Nagito and decided to go back to my room. I kind of have a similar outlook. So I can relate to that. Why am I doing this? I need to be stopped. This is unhealthy. Oh. <laughs> This is an unhealthy relationship. Hmm. Sucks! This sucks! I can't stop! I don't know what it is! I can't stop! I can't believe how huge these buildings are. <sighs> <laughs> I'm so happy I'm about to wet myself. Okay. Hey. Do you want to share our ideas about this building? Uh, instant regret. I know I'm gonna regret hanging out with him. I know I am. Like, I'm just, I'm gonna regret it. This is... This is quite interesting. Thanks. Uh, do you like it or not? Okay. <laughs> to tell you the truth, I'm really happy, Hajime. With everything you've learned about me, you're still talking to me like this. Ah, oh, don't make me regret it! Don't get the wrong idea. I'm just a coward. I'm scared to leave someone like you alone when I don't understand you at all. How admirable. Personally, I think it's great. It shows great courage to try to understand something you don't understand. Courage? Is that what this is called? Because, yeah, uh, I do be trying to understand you. That's why I'm here. I don't, I don't know if this is courage, though. I don't think that's the word I feel right now. You're definitely someone who embodies hope. I don't know about that either. Hey. I wonder what kind of light your talent is gonna unleash. This is exciting! I really want to find out soon. Who cares about me? Let's talk about you. Sure thing, I'll talk about anything you want! Um... So let's start talking about the moment that I came into this world. What? Do you even remember that? <laughs> Good point. Hey. But before that, can I ask you something? Hajime. What do you think good luck is? Oh god. Good luck, huh? I'm not really sure I understand, but I think what Nagito is trying to say is... 
Are you trying to say that good luck is absolute power? It's obvious. Precisely for me, that's exactly what good luck is. Regardless, it's a power that has terrible results due to the fact that I can't wield it with my own will. An absolute power that you can't will wield with your own will. Isn't that a dangerous thing to have? Uh, no, I see. That's just how Nagito views it. Hey. Now then, let's start talking about me. Hmm, where should I start? <laughs> I know, this happened when I was in elementary school. Actually, One day, my family and I were planning to board an airplane from the San Cristo Ball, Ball Airport. Where in the world is that? But surprise, surprise, after we boarded, the airplane was hijacked. Don't you think that's the worst luck? But surprisingly, a meteorite fell at exactly the right... What? <laughs> For a meteorite, it was only the size of a closed fist. Oh, I'm sorry, what? Anyway, that falling meteorite struck the hijacker and prevented any further problems. What the fuck? Don't you think that's an amazing act of good luck? But the meteorite also hit my parents and they died in- Oh my god. My brain can't handle this story! <laughs> Holy shit, what a roller coaster. Oh my god, emotional whiplash and how many lines? Five lines. Five. Holy shit. Okay. Don't you think that's an act of ter- that's a terrible act of bad luck? I... But in the end, I obtained my freedom and an immense inheritance. What? Oh my god! Why do I talk to this man?! <laughs> oh my god! See, it was really amazing good luck all along! Oh my god! Oh my god! I cannot handle him! I'm done! Oh my god! No! <laughs> Nagito spoke about this event so optimistically, and my understanding just couldn't keep up with him. Yeah, that's accurate. A plane hijacking and a meteorite, and his parents died right in front of him. <sighs> and there was also this one time I in middle school when I was kidnapped by a murderer. It Why does this keep going? Why does this keep going? Why? <laughs> why are we still going? Man, don't you think that's just the worst luck? But, but coincidentally, I found a lottery ticket inside the trash bag that the murderer stuffed me in. <laughs> oh my god. I legit cannot think of a time in my life where I've had so much emotional whiplash in five minutes. As I have experienced just now. After I was safely taken in by the police, I checked out the numbers without giving it much thought. Amazing! Surprise! I won 300 million dollars! Even I was amazed by this splendid act of good luck. What? It's no use, my head's starting to hurt. I am so glad that Hajime is actually the same feeling as me right now. Great. Um. And right before I entered Hope's Peak Academy, <laughs> no, I shouldn't tell you this story. What, because it's plot relevant? Is that what you're gonna say? It's too plot relevant for your character, so you can't tell me that story, bitch! Oh, I hate this man. It's impertinent of me to burden you with all this because of my pointless situation. Yeah? After dominating the conversation, Nagito left. I feel like I still don't know much about him. We learned absolutely nothing. But it seems like he has an understandable reason for his blind faith towards hope. I feel like I was able to at least understand that. Nope. 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 I regret everything that just happened. More free time. Oh my god. Okay, here is my thought. If we do the last one, he's done. I don't ever have to talk to Nagito ever again. Just get the last one out of the way. Just get it done. We're doing it. I'm just getting it done. 
I just like, I do not, I cannot handle this man anymore. All right, this is the last time I hang out with this man. Hello there. Hajime, are you getting along with the girls at Grey Pals? Ugh. Impossible. Your gracious invitation makes me want to cry. There's no way I could decline. I spent time with Nagito talking about various things. This is... thanks. Hey. Hajime, why are you... No, the reason doesn't matter. I just want to feel grateful for this good luck. I want to be thankful that there's someone who's interested in trash like me. Oh. The reason I'm here is because I wanted to hear the rest of what you were going to say earlier. Yep. I don't mind, it's no big deal anyway. Like I said before, my parents are dead. Since I had no other relatives, it took d direct action against me. It? What does it mean? Well... My diagnosis. What? Stage 3 malignant lymphoma, and to top it off, it's accompanied by a fronto frontotemporal dementia. I have to Google. <laughs> I don't know what this is. What is... I actually have no idea what malignant lymphoma is. What? Wait, 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 don't- I'm not gonna get caught up. I'm not gonna get caught up in this, because he's about to say, But I'm extremely lucky, so they found a miraculous cure for me, and I'm totally fine now. Huh? This is troubling. Even now, my brain is deteriorating bit by bit while I'm speaking with you- Oh my god! You're- you're kidding me, right? Jeez. My life expectancy is between half a year to- WHAT?! But right after I was diagnosed, I was accepted into Hope's Peak Academy. I believe that balanced things- that balanced things out, but now things are- th these killings are occurring, you know? <laughs> as soon as my life entered the final round, it quickly became a roller coaster ride. But it's going to be alright. No matter the bad luck that happens, good luck always lies just beyond it. I... The reason I'm alive is because I always believe that there's hope no matter what. <laughs> Do you understand me now? That's what I've been believing, but still... Hajime... You and I are a lot alike. Actually... That's why you understand my feelings, I felt that from the start. Uh, I don't feel the unique aura that exists in those who have talent from you. I only detect the scent of a miserable bystander just like me. That may be so, but... I'm not... Miserable. I'm different from you. Perhaps? It seems there's no one who's willing to inherit my soul. I have no parents, no siblings, no relatives, not even friends or acquaintances. Because of my self-righteous thoughts, everyone distanced themselves from me. I was fine with that while I was still healthy, but it's quite lonely to die alone. Now that I'm on the verge of death, I'm finally realized what I wanted all along. Somebody's love. I can't. I can't. book about something like that the other day. It was right in front of me. It was right of me to cite a book written from the, for the masses. Thanks to that, I was able to gain your empathy. Catha Pride. Hehehe. <laughs> 
Yes, I'm satisfied now. You were lying just now. No, everything you've set up into this point, all of it, it was all lies? Right. Have you finally decided to kill me? If you want, I'll prepare the perfect crime, then you can kill me. I am so goddamn done. I need, like, a minute. Let me tell you something, buddy. In this current moment, I have never been filled with so much despair in my life. And I'm pretty sure that's something you don't want. Let's commit the crime together so despair can become the foundation of hope. Ugh. You can do it. I believe in you. After all, you tolerated someone like me this entire time. I'm sure a bright hope is sleeping inside you, too. No, I literally am only filled with the deepest, darkest despair right now. I assure you. There ain't no hope in this dream. Nagito, just tell me one thing and be honest. If you didn't have your ultimate luck, what would you be doing instead? You're right. <laughs> I guess I would probably be living a peaceful hope, life. Hope, hope, a boring, hope, normal hope, hope, life with hope, no hope, hope and no despair. Huh. Sounds a lot like the pro tag of the last game, if you ask me. I see. That's all. Goodbye. I turned my back to him, and as I walked away, I could hear Nagito's voice in the distance. Please, don't forget. From the bottom of my heart. I am truly in love with the hope that sleeps inside you. In the end, everything Nagito said, I don't know what was true and what was lies. But even so, there might have been a definite truth hidden somewhere in those words. If there wasn't, there is no way I could feel this mysterious bond between Nagito and me. If he does obtain the hope that he wants, what is he going to do? Strangely enough, I feel like I want to see that. I don't. Oh my god. What did I just get? What? I hope you're having fun with Nagito. What? What is this game joking? This game is fucking joking! What? What? What is happening? Can anyone explain to me what is happening in this fucking game? Holy shit! I regret ever talking to this man! Holy fuck! What does it say? No, I need to know exactly what it says right now. Nagito's favorite boxer shorts. Even when the laundry got soaking wet from a sudden rainstorm, this pair of lucky underwear was the only thing that stayed dry. I hate this game. I fucking hate this game. What? You're kidding. This is a joke. This is one gigantic joke. None of this is real. None of this is real. Oh my fucking god. I am so perplexed right now. Oh my god. Oh Jesus Christ. Oh 
Okay. Look at Sonia's face. And then look at... Her last name is Sonia Komaeda. Boom! Same eyes, same hair. Oh my god, this info. <laughs> this info is so innocent. He's really hard on himself, but he's really calm and easygoing. We get along well, and being with him brightens my mood. Uh. Yeah, yeah, totally. Yeah. I just want to get to know him a little better. <laughs> Uh, can you guys remember the good old days? The good old days? Yeah, whenever he was like such a sweet, innocent little bean. Man, he really brightens my mood. We're like BFFs. Yeah. <laughs> uh, no. 